I'd say friend, more of a casual acquaintance I did on the legal race with once. But um, yeah, he bought me this car. I understand, and you can drink and drive and say it's an accident. I can drink and drive. Vehicle, Perfect. Still... Right, I'll catch you later. There, here you go. So, can you pay that for me? And have a great day. Come on out, sir. Come on out. All right. I really don't feel comfortable sucking on the end of that. <laughs> right. Hold on. Can you just shoot me in the head? I can't be bothered. Oh shit, I'm in the wrong line. I wanna go here. Hello, officer. Hello, officer. <laughs> anyway, what's up, guys? GT Game here, and welcome back to OCRP. Uh, oh, something's going on in there. And um, sorry, I haven't had any videos recently. Well, not as many. Um, as I've said before, I've been busy with work and they're changing my schedule and whatever. But I do have some exciting news. Me and Matthew are currently working on, it's a work in progress, but Matthew is starting a YouTube channel. Um, we're currently working on logos and getting it set up, he's actually got the channel set up now. And um, bleh. I'm going to teach him how to edit, that was a weird noise I just made, sorry. Bleh. I'm going to teach him how to edit videos and basic things like that and how to manage his channel. And uh, then he's going to start making videos for you guys, so you'll get to see his perspective as well, which is uh, really cool. So if you guys would like to see that, let us know in the comments. And as soon as he's finished making his channel and got logos and all that sorted, then I will um, I'll give him a shout out and let you guys know what his channel's called. But anyway, back to today. This is one of those days where I don't know what's going on. <laughs> I literally just get in a car and drive and do stuff. I'm in the Crown Vic today with spotlights just to get in trouble potentially. <laughs> See how the cops feel about that. I don't know if they're illegal. I'll be completely transparent there. I do not know the legality of that. Um, another thing that's worth mentioning, there is a bug. 5M broke stuff as always. So you might randomly start hearing voices the in-game text chat, like voice chat, is a bit broken and sometimes people on the other side of the map can hear you. Um, when I loaded in just then, someone was on a traffic stop up north, he took that corner a bit fast, and I could hear them all the way down in the city, so oh, that scared the shit out of me. So yeah, just be wary of that. Do you mind? <laughs> Where did you get your license? Ugh. God, these spotlights work really well. I'm just going to follow the AI ambulance. <laughs> Why not? Sure, that won't get me noticed at all, following him with spotlights on. Where do you reckon he's going to go? I'm genuinely curious. I'm going to keep following him. I'm probably going to run out of gas, but... Considering this is a life or death emergency, he doesn't seem to be going very quick. <laughs> you know, I'm just pointing that out. Make way for the ambulance. Clear the way. That's a highway patrol. <laughs> yeah, I think I was good on speed then. You didn't seem to question it. Oh my god, this ambulance is losing me. Don't be a cop in these bushes. No, I believe we're good. That's good. I want to know where he's going. <laughs> this is probably one of the weirder things I've done, but, you know. I'm going to turn the spotlights off. That's too much. That's going to get me noticed like fuck. Oh, he just turned the lights off. What the fuck? <laughs> I'm just going to drive around with the takedowns on then. Why not? So the great mystery of where the ambulance goes, he gets to Sandy Shore's exit, 
turns his lights off and drives normally. Because, <laughs> you know, perhaps his call, call got cancelled. I'll give him the benefit of the doubt. Hey, someone's got a, um... Oh, what are they called? Neon bike? No. You know, the shiny bike. I can't remember what they're called. <laughs> ah, well. That's cool, though. I didn't even know you can buy them. I need to look into that. I would have chose a different colour, though. Yeah, that's cool. What are they called? Fuck. So I'm putting in the description. I can't think what they call them. I'm sitting the tip of my tongue. The Zen bike. No. Is it? I have no idea. But yeah, so far I've just been driving around with my takedowns on. <laughs> Why not? And the um, the Mustache Foundation Mustache in the windscreen is my alibi. If they're like, hey man, people don't think you're a cop. It's like, well, no cop has a pink mustache siren. So, pfft, jog on. Sorry, I was watching uh, Hot Fuzz earlier. <laughs> it's a great film, really funny. Oh, there's a sheriff. Nah, <laughs> I had a feeling that might happen. <laughs> Do not follow me. Do not question my authority. Because why not pull over in a sketch location? And just as a treat, slash me, um, you notice driver's seat belt is not on. How you doing, sir? Deputy Johnson with the San Andreas... I'm sorry, with the Sheriff's Office. How you doing today? Hey, I'm not bad, man. How's it going? Alright, well, the, well, the reason I'm pulling you over is because you, uh, you had your headlights, the takedown lights on when, when, when you met me. What's going on? Yeah, I put them on by accident. I overdid the toggle for the headlights. Sorry. <laughs> okay. Alright, do you have your license, registration, and proof of insurance with you? Uh, yeah, sure, here you go. My name's Wrigley Ballsack. <laughs> Wrigley Ballsack, okay. Is this your vehicle, Mr. Uh, Ballsack? Excuse me, Mr. Wrigley Ballsack, I can hear you. Uh... Mr. Ballsack? Sorry, what'd you say? Is this your vehicle, sir? Uh, no, Oop, sorry. Hang on. Okay, then who owns this vehicle? Um, I can't remember his name. <laughs> uh, I know that's a far-fetched story. Okay. Is there a reason you got your gun out? Yeah, that that caught me off guard. Yeah, My there's voice was been being... a lot of stuff happening lately. This is just for our own protection, okay? Oh, okay. Um, yeah, it's my friend's car, but I can't remember his name. He he bought it for me. It's very nice. You're... So it's your friend's car, but you can't remember his name. Yeah, well, I say friend, more of a casual acquaintance. I did an illegal race with once. But, um, yeah, he bought okay. me this car. And I can't remember his and name. Why did he... Okay, so so you, you barely know him and he bought you a car? Yeah, because I beat him in the race. Okay, all right. And what's going on with the uh, seatbelt there? Why, don't, why aren't you wearing it? Uh, I I just took it off when you pulled me over. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right, Mr. Balls, I'll give you a tie for me. I'll be back with you in a minute, okay? Okay, no worries. <laughs> yeah, that that threw me off guard. The the hunter guy. That's the guy I heard when I logged on. So either his chat is broken, my chat's broken, or both of ours is broken because. We can hear each other wherever we are on the map, so... Yeah, that threw me off guard. I just assumed it was his chat was broken and I could only hear him. But no, apparently everyone can hear me, so that's good. So, sorry to the... Nine other people in this chat with me, and... Uh, actually, no, there's a lot of... Probably about sorry to 15 people. I do apologise. Um, <laughs> 5M's fault. Not mine. I'm innocent. One thing that's bugging me with this Crown Vic, like, it's a beautiful car, but the lights 
on the back, like the tail lights, that texture does not look right to me. I'm just wondering what he's gonna do about <laughs> the fact that I don't know who owns the car. Well, it was. Shh, what's his name? It's Fred's character. Is Bobby? Is it Bobby? Thing is, if I say the wrong name, that's definitely gonna. Um. Registration. Yes. Y yes. Yeah. Now let's be professional. Yes. Comes back to R O. That's all I can put. I can't remember his name. <laughs> um. I'm just gonna put insurance valid. Oh, wrong button. <laughs> what would you do if you was a cop and it was just print citation? Dude. Alright, Mr. Balsack. So what's gonna happen is I'm gonna have to give you a citation today for the high beam violation. It's just because you got those takedown lights on that vehicle. It's super duper bright, and I couldn't see anything when you came at me. Okay. Look, man, it was an you accident. Need to be careful, especially. With, I mean, I I can't. We can't have people driving around with their takedown lights on their CVPIs. You're blinding everybody. Yeah, it was an accident. I okay. I overturned the knob. That's not not something I thought I'd say today. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Well. Well, you did, and uh, that's on you. If you want to take it up in court, that's all up to you, okay? Written warning. That's a that's an idea. Can I... uh, it's all written in the system. I can't redo it, okay? Aren't you meant to wait for for me to sign it before you do that? Way caught you out. I put it in the computer. I'm not gonna go back there, remove everything, and redo all that, all that I've done, okay? I'll give you a fiver. <laughs> that's not gonna happen, dude. Okay. I mean, that's not it's very nice. Be... Okay, listen to me, listen to me. It's gonna be a hundred dollar citation, it's not much, okay? Okay. And three points on your license. You're already at four, which will bring you up to seven, okay? I'll tell you what, what if we split the price to make it kinda like a real... So you pay fifty, I'll pay fifty. That's not gonna happen, sir. I wasn't the one driving around with my high beams. But it was an accident. Okay. You should understand that I understand it was an accident. <laughs> I understand, and you can drink and drive and say it's an accident. I can drink and drive. Vehicle, Perfect. Still... Right, I'll catch you later. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna need your signature here at the bottom for me, okay? Okay. It's not a mission skill, but anyone you'll have who days knows to my channel fine or take it up in court, okay? We'll know what's happening next. Okay. Signs, fines. <laughs> Alright, do you have any other questions for me, Mr. Baltak? No, that's it, officer. Have a great day. You as well. Have a good one. I'm gonna go drink and drive now, thanks for the permission. Right. <laughs> I mean, he basically gave me permission. So, um... Not Yellow Jack. Too obvious, like, seriously. Licorice? Yeah, liquor ice. <laughs> I was in two minds there. It's like, yeah, is, is that too obvious? Nah, it's not. Liquor ice is where I'm going. Right, let's crack open a cold one. Actually, no. I'm just going to buy it here. I'm actually going to take the liquor somewhere else to drink it. And uh, let's see how the cops deal with public intoxication. That's something I've never done before. Are you kidding me? You can't buy liquor at Liquor Ace. That makes perfect sense. <laughs> you know, it's not like it's totally not in the name or anything. That's the back of my car. Mm. Discount beers, lot tech, which I assume is short for lottery tickets. I also love the way it's a red curb in a parking zone. <laughs> so that makes sense. You cannot park here in this parking zone. Right. Seatbelt off. Oh my god, I actually wore my seatbelt for once. 
Right, if they don't sell liquor in here, I'm gonna be pissed. Oh, thank God. Uh, wine, beer, vodka, tequila, or whiskey? Um... Wrigley's kind of a, like, criminal dude, but he's also kind of hipster, so I'm thinking... Okay, that was not the right button. I reckon he's a wine kind of guy. That's a lot of wine. <laughs> Obviously, I purchased it in bottles, not glasses, so I can take it with me. Because apparently the liquor store doesn't sell liquor anymore. I don't know, I might have to... That could be a glitch. Jaden. Alright, let's find somewhere scenic where I can drink this shit. That Tahoe is still there. <laughs> he must be bored out of his freaking mind, and that Porsche just totally wrote his back end off. I just, what am I going to do? Am I going to go on patrol? Nah, going to sit there and eat donuts and hope that the stereotypes don't emerge. That was very illegal what I just did. I'm thinking Mirror Park. That was, you know what? If you're going to half blow red light, you might as well blow all of them. <laughs> that one was green, technically. Sorry. Just wanted to flick a drift there. <laughs> Whatever. Yeah, I'm thinking Mirror Park would be a nice scenic place to get drunk. Public intoxication. Nice. Ooh, that was close. That was full brakes. The brakes aren't very good in this car. Need to take note of that. Do you know what my favourite thing about this entire thing is? If I get in a pursuit or anything in this car and they don't know my name, it's registered to Fred and Fred's in server. So if he's playing his character that this car's registered to, he could end up getting arrested for something you totally didn't do. <laughs> that, uh, that's not really a great place to park, is it? Move, woman, I swear I will run you over. And you are taking the piss. You're not meant to stop forever at a stop sign, just a second or two. There must be a parking place. Oh, there is. It's over here, I remember. Remember now. Blow that stop sign. That's a curb. <laughs> this Crown Vic handles like dog shit, fair play. They didn't need that. In fact, I'm taking it home, apparently. It's like I'm already drunk, but I promise I'm not. Actually, no, I'm going to have that space there. Sorry, my OCD is just killing me right now. Nice. Nailed it. Right, let's go get drunk in public. Right, wine. Lots and lots of wine. Let's use one. Oh, let's get our nice little pink bar in the corner full. So, four wines. Yep, I'm pretty hammered right now. <laughs> I forgot how amazing this effect was. I'm just going to be, like, chilling over here on this park bench. And there's no dispatch on right now, which is good, so I can text the police, telling them to, um, that I'm really offended because there's a drunk guy. Because <laughs> 2019, you're allowed to be offended at anything and everything. That is how it rolls. So I am going to text the police right now. Drunk male at 431 Mirror Park, being rude to members of the public, white top, jeans and black hair. And let's make that one anonymous. So, uh... Let, let's be, let's be drunk at, yo, yo, hipster, fuck you, <laughs> oh, I, I need to, I'm, I'll admit I'm a little bit tipsy, you know, I'm gonna make it harder for, I'm gonna go over on the, um, on the thingamajigger over here, <laughs> oh, I'm so, that, that's a post. Uh, I wonder if they can spot me. Ah, uh, drunk cyclisting, cyclisting, cycling sting. And then basically, I want to ride the bike. It's nice to not be at work for once. Uh, I stole someone's bike. Oh, I'm so sorry, Mr. Dude. Uh, I'm. I'm s 
Oh, whoops. No, uh, oh, there's a post there. Uh, uh, oh, 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 shit. My bike. Uh, yeah. Sir, you're just gonna leave your, you're just gonna leave your bike in the water right there. Uh, can can you get it out for me? It's it, it's not mine. Why are you riding it then? I borrowed hey, borrowed it from that. Oh, sorry, from that. Uh, where where do you go? There was there was there was a guy over there. <laughs> sorry. Um, can you get my bike for me? <laughs> I mean, I mean, you're the one that put it there, but I don't want you getting hurt. So we can we can worry about the bike in a moment. Uh, why don't we just start with your name? What's your name, man? Um. Wrigley. <coughs> Sorry. My, my name's Wrigley B Ballsack. Wrigley. Wrigley Ballsack, alright. You got anything, uh. Are, are you like okay? You're kind of staggering over yourself right here. No, I think. Like here. Uh, I'll be honest with you, Matt. I'm pretty sure. <coughs> Sorry, I, I think I cut my knee when I fell in the pond. No, oh, she need an ambulance? No, it's just, it's just a cut. I'm I'm big I'm a big boy. I gotcha. If you come over to my car, I can get my uh, get my first aid kit out and give you a mandate for that. No, okay. Um, yeah. Th this yeah, cop, uh, this lovely guy, I he was great. He gave me a ticket for bullshit. He told me I could go and drink. He said I can drink drive. It's great. So basically, I've got he a diplomatic immunity, like basically. He said you could do what? He pulled me over, he was like, you can go and drink drive. I was like, hey, okay, man. I, I didn't want to drive, that's dangerous, but... Um, uh, well, you you most certainly can't drink and drive. Uh, here, here's a band-aid. Put that on your knee. Uh, th thank you. No you uh, <laughs> oh. certainly can't drink and drive. But, uh, I hope you're not doing band. that. A, you know, he, he might have two. meant you can drink like water and drive, can't drink like alcohol. Oh. Nah, he, he was like, you can go drink drive. He, he told me straight, man. Okay. But we're, let, let's not do that, though. I'm a, I'm, I'm a clarify that for you. You can't, can't drink and drive. No, I, I got a note of him over here. I'll go get it for you. It says that I got a ticket and that, that I can drink drive. When, when, when did you get this ticket? Like, um, what time is that? It's, uh, it's getting around, it's getting pretty late. It's around night time, six or seven, I think. Yeah, it was before that. <laughs> Sorry. It was like today, I think. <laughs> okay. So, what are you doing out here today in uh, Mirror Park? Oh, I'm, I'm just enjoying the water. Well I, well, I didn't mean to go in the water, actually, but it was nice. I was... What was I doing? Oh, I was sitting on the bench. <laughs> okay. You, like, live around here, or you just, uh, you have a day off from work or something? No, I'm just... I can't remember. <laughs> Look, I, I got a, a letter in my car that says I can drink. Look, I, I, let's, I'll go show you. My car's like um, yours, but shiny. <laughs> Alright, where's your car? Is it in the parking lot over here? Yeah, it's just, just over there. Let's go down to the range later and fire off the two okay. Be careful crossing the road. I don't want you getting hit by a car. No, no, don't. I'm Look always out. careful. Your ball sack. Uh, let, me, here, let me stop the traffic for you. Oh, that's very kind of you. But yeah, that cop said, like, I basically got diplomatic immunity for drinking and driving. He was a great dude. Oh, there's a curb there. Right. <laughs> I, I, I don't really think that's how that works. No, I mean, if a cop says it, it must be true. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I think you just might be misunderstanding. 
All right. So where? So so where's the letter? Or where's the note, Mr. Bond? No, no. It's in my car. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna get it for you. No, no, what? No, 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 no. Don't, no, don't go through the driver's seat. No, just getting it through the passenger seat. And ticket to cop. No, here you go. Okay. So, can you here. pay that right. for me? Right. And come on out. Have a great no, day. No, I can't. No, come on out, sir. Come on out. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> can can you pay that for me? Oh, I let Hey, 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 she, no, they hit my no. car. No, no, no. That, that no, dude no, no. hit my car. Face your crown vic. Face your crown Look, vic, Mr. Ball. There's, Stand right there. there's no. scratches at the front no. here. No. Oh, so, no. Dude, can you not no, hit my not car? No, we're not doing that today. No, hey, no, come here. On. Get your arm. Come over here. They hit my yeah. car. What? I, I couldn't say you could leave, Mr. Balzac. Why did you get in your car and drive away from me? Because the cops no, said no, I could. Do... No, I did not say that at all. No, not you. The I other. Said if you get the note, I. Isn't, no, I'm is... not talking about him. Right. It was Officer. Um. I don't know. It's on the ticket. I think it was Mark. Marku or something like that. It was a weird name. Like Mark, I think. Marcus. <laughs> Yeah, that's... He was a great guy. He said I could drink and drive. He's... He basically gave me permission. He, he did give me permission. <gasps> Have you yeah, got any paracetamol? No. He did, honestly. He was like, so you can go and drink and drive. I was like, hey, that sounds like a plan. And then I said, you sure I could drink and drive? He went, yeah, 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 why not? Hey, buddy, you kids still in the ignition? I gotta move your car. Um... It's not my car, but it kind of is. But yeah, they're, they're in the ignition. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, who, okay, whose car is it, Wrigley? I can't remember. You really confused me here. I can't remember. I told Mr. Marcus the, the nice drink drive copper. It was... Basically, I did a race uh, with a dude, and I won the race. So he bought me the car, but I can't remember his name. But he, he was very nice. He bought me a car. So we've been drinking tonight, right? Right, Mr. Balsack. We've been drinking alcohol. Well, I wouldn't say that. Because yes or no question, right? Have you been drinking tonight or not? I invoke my something. What's the amendment called? The one where I can't talk. The fifth. That one. Okay. Because we're playing, we're playing the legal game. I will tell you're being detained right now. Uh, for suspicion of what is now DUI, before it was public intoxication, now it's DUI. But I got permission, right. dude. You don't have permission. I Let totally did. Let me see what it says. I don't think you wrote it down, that's just a ticket. Can you pay that for me, by the way? But he... he... No, I... no, not really. Headlight. <laughs> Violation from... Officer Marcus. <laughs> but yeah, he was like, you can drink drive. I was like, you sure? He went, yeah, why not? I should have invited him out, then you'd believe me. So, what was... Right, just, just give me one second. I'm, I'm going to hit him up on the radio. Let me see what he's got to say about this. Just give me a sec. Okay, tell him I'm his biggest fan. Can I have his autograph? Can you pay my ticket for me? It's only a hundred bucks. I'll give it back to you. Okay, he says he doesn't remember anything about uh, telling you you could drink drive, as you call it. He was totally lying, dude. He was like, go drink and drive. I'll admit, I find it a little weird, but if a cop tells you to jump, you don't ask how high, you just keep jumping until they look happy. My dad told me that. He was a great guy, but I can't remember his name. <laughs> okay. Dave, is that you or is that Marcel standing next to you? No, that's that's me. All right. Are either of you are either of you date certified? Yes. 
No, I don't want to go on a date. I just want a ticket. I, I want. No, we're not gonna go on a date. Perfect. Well, yeah, I can do it if you want. Me too. Am I free to go? No. Told you to take. Okay, so, uh, so you had something to drink tonight? Is that correct? No comment. Alcoholic beverages, that is. No comment. Hey, you can smell. I, 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 I smelt it on him as soon as I started. Okay. That's, okay. that's have you, aftershave. Very, very strong wine-like aftershave. Strong wine? <laughs> no, it smells like okay. wine, my aftershave. Oh. Yeah, that's a good story. Uh -huh. Yeah, it's okay. elf it? aftershave. Uh, okay, okay, we're making up stuff now, okay. Do um, <laughs> you have any medical conditions I should know about? Uh, no, but can I have a paracetamol? Drugs. Can you have what? A paracetamol. I think my aftershave's making me dizzy. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> I don't carry those. Sorry. Your aftershave is gonna. Oh, okay. Did you drink it? No, I drank the wine. I mean, no, my aftershave smells like wine. And you. Uh, okay. Uh, okay. I'm gonna open your cuffs real quick. We're gonna do a little uh, test with you to determine whether or not you actually had something to drink tonight. Okay. So, First, first thing we are going to do is uh, you see the the line in front of you, basically that goes across the curb. Yeah, I see that. Kind of. Yeah. It looks okay. kind of wavy. Um, <laughs> yeah, that happens. Okay. Uh, I want you to walk along that line, uh, heel to toe, ten steps. Count those out loudly and turn left, do a one eighty flip basically, and then come back ten steps. Okay. okay. I'm gonna go uh, grab the uh, magical device from the uh, boot, okay? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and turn. Okay. One, two, three, four, six, seven. No, that's not right. Okay, so I'm, I'm gonna start again. Two, three. three you, can, you can just come back. Four, five. Six, seven, um, seven, no, eight, no, no, okay, nine, ten. No, 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 no. I did it. Oh. <laughs> yeah, you, you did something okay. all right. Let us uh, call get the trooper. Back. Get out of the road. Get out of the road. Oh, okay. Follow the trooper. There you um, go. Am I free to go? Good. No. We, we need to do some more tests, so let's go a bit closer to the, the house okay. so we don't step oh. out in the road again. Shit. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, are you oh, alright, right, sir? Are, yeah. you, are you feeling dizzy a bit? No, it was a pothole. I, I hit a pothole. Okay. Okay. <laughs> that didn't you, you even did make perfectly sense. on that first test. So, here's the second one. I want you to count upwards from th three to seven. But I just did piece. that. No, you just counted your steps. No, okay. you can't upwards from One, three to seven. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, perfect. I started at one by accident. And now uh, give me the ABCs from E to J, please. Start at E and at J. Thank you. E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, L, M. No, that's not right. I think I fucked up. Um, no, no, can I try did, again? E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N. Where was I meant to stop? Mm -hmm. I genuinely yes, forgot. Uh, at J. Well, okay. <laughs> no, I passed it. That's fine. I, I basically right. did 110%. Okay. Right. And now we just... <laughs> uh, yeah. Yeah, you did it 110%, perfectly fine. Okay, and here's the last thing. I just want you to blow ah, into this little it. device thingy. It's a PBT. It will give us an amount of alcohol you drink. Okay, okay. Just start whenever and then just give us a constant blow whenever <laughs> you like it and, and when to be picked up. So, okay, continue, 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 oh. keep going, keep going. Keep going. <laughs> Fine, thank you. Uh, blows. What's a good 0 0.17? That'll do. Wow, okay. 0 0.017. So, uh, congratulations, Mr. Balsack. You won the big prize tonight.
Boo? Hey, hey, jail for DOI. But I've got diplomatic immunity. The cop basically told me that. He said only for drink driving, though. Right, only. Oh, okay. Diplomatic immunity for drink driving. Okay. Yeah, he, he basically um, told me that. Which country would that be? Which um, country would that be? Germany? No, this one. He yeah. was he was like you're good this to do one. it man. I was like fine officer. You you're, this, you're this like king. What, yes. What, okay, what is this this one country this? What is it? This one here is the great state yeah. of Los Santos city county San no. San Andres. Yeah. yeah. Okay. That's exactly what it's called. South yes. Flap. Okay. So here's the deal. You've <laughs> made all of the tests. So I can't yeah. There is no doubt you have been uh, you are under the influence of. Well, I could have told you that. That's pretty obvious. You could have just asked. Yes. <laughs> we did. We twice, did. and then you gave us the story about uh, your aftershave and stuff. So. My chin's very elongated. Oh yeah, I Mate, forgot about uh, that. The officer is gonna take you down to uh, the metro, and they were probably gonna take a blood sample of you, just to confirm your blood alcohol test. But at this yeah, point in time, we'll you are on the... Please don't, I'm scared this, of leeches. At this point in time, you are... Okay, we will find a way. But <laughs> as I said, at this point in time, you are scared under arrest for driving under influence. Everything that comes from now on is just to confirm. That... We already have found out. Those dudes that hit me, can I have their insurance? Hey, Mr. Balzac, I'm gonna go search your vehicle. Is there anything in there that, um... Maybe I should be aware of before I go in there? Um... Um, um, no. I mean, no. <laughs> is there anything on, uh, is there anything on your person that's, uh, not gonna be too good? Because I'm gonna search you as well. No, no, nothing. Fines. I hate. Ten closed bottles and five empty bottles. Of wine uh, in okay. the so we got, uh, I'm feeling quite a few bottles. No, they're right they're they're in the car. Uh, you, that's that's my enormous uh, man yeah, yeah, yeah. man okay, thing. Okay, I gotcha. It uh, truly I, I is gotcha. enormous. I was blessed with an enormous penis. That All right, Mr. Paul, I can get you across the street right now. Like the trooper said, you're under arrest for DUI, and you're also going to be under arrest for public intoxication. But and, that's uh, the same thing. Bike you were riding. Well, they are sort of the same thing. Well, the crime of public intoxication was you overall acting like a, uh, uh, you know, just being a disturbance, driving your bike, or riding your bike into the lake and whatnot. It DUI wasn't my bike. Then for driving away from me. But yeah, I, I had I permission to do that. part of the problem. All right, I think this trooper hey, uh, wants Jake? to talk to you before I, yeah. Yeah, what's up? I got uh, seven open containers in his vehicle, and uh, <laughs> there was uh, quite a few in the back. On a Nice. Alright, Mr. Balzac, before you get killed, I'm gonna get you in the back of my vehicle right here. Take a seat in the back seat right there. There you go. Oh, they just get wore off. Seat on. I wonder what they're talking about. <laughs> God, I'm actually starting to sound drunk now. God damn it. Why don't I just get drunk and make a video? Actually, no, that would be a very bad idea. <laughs> I'd probably end up getting, like, arrested in real life. That would be a very bad idea. Just get drunk, make a video, wake up in a jail cell, like, wait, what? <laughs> and we're off to the yeah, station. We take care of that bike before we leave. Need to get out of the water. Yeah. I don't know where the guy is whose bicycle that was. Uh, but can he I... must have got it, because I don't see it. No, oh, I was going to ask if I can keep it. That... Um, ticket I got earlier that I gave you. Yeah, yeah. I'll be giving that back to you, don't you worry. Well, what I was going to say is, can you pay it for me, and I'll give you the money back? <laughs> uh, okay, so, firstly, that's about the tenth time you've asked, and I'm going to answer you for the tenth time, and it's uh, going to be no. Why if I give you a fiver? Five whole dollars. Why don't you just put the five dollars towards paying that ticket? 
Because that's just effort, and I, I'm not experienced with tickets. I don't know how to do it. You, as a police officer, you you know how to do it. So if you do it, I'll give you like I'll, I'll give I'll chuck you twenty dollars. Okay. Now we're up to twenty dollars that you could just put towards the ticket. Um. If you ask again and reference money in exchange for the ticket being uh, squashed, I will then charge you with bribery, so I would think that you should stop right where you are, Mr. Balzac. That's not very nice. <laughs> I'm just telling you, I'm not, I'm not going to unless you do it again, so don't do it again. You know, I saw a unicorn once. It was in a field. It looked like a donkey with a cone on its head, but it was definitely a unicorn. Alright, so just give me one moment here. I call top bunk. Little, little map. I wonder if I can get up there. Ugh. Nope. Not happening. A quick question about the vehicle. Um, that vehicle is not registered to you, um, so... Uh, yeah, I told you that. Or something? I can't remember the dude's oh, okay. name, but I borrowed it. It is... I won it in a race, like, I, I beat him in a race and he said he'd buy me a car, and he totally did, the guy's fucking stupid, but he was like, hey man, I'll buy you a car, so he bought me a car, and I can't remember his name, but he was very nice, he bought me a car. Where was, uh, where, uh, where was the, where was the race? Uh, somewhere where it was definitely legal, out of state, of course, where you yes. can't prosecute me that place. <laughs> of course. I'm not um, stupid. So, uh, of course. So, yeah, so, of course. So, if I call the registered owner, uh, he, he's going to say that it's totally all right that you have the car and that and that everything you're saying is true, right? Yeah, of course he will. You bought everyone in the race a car, a Crown Vec. I can, well, I can give you I his number. Be in that race. Here you go. There's his number. I put it in the. on. I wrote it down in the little box in the corner for you. It's so hard trying to hint without saying the stupid. Alright, appreciate that. There we go. Let me just uh, let me just give him a call. I just want to make sure you're not driving a stolen vehicle or anything. That's, that's the only reason I'm calling him. I'd never do that. So what did I get away with? I got away with stealing a bike. <laughs> Technically speeding. Road traffic accident. Running a stop sign. Not bad. I did get public intoxication and DUI. I'm not sure. I think they're both misdemeanors, but I'm not 100% on that. But overall, it's not looking too badly. I am going to go over here, face this way, and do... Sorry about that squeak in the background, by the way. That's my chair. It's from Ikea, so it's good, but it's squeaky. Did he answer you? Yeah, sometimes he takes a while to answer his phone. Yeah, I'm just asking him one more question. Uh, he said he did give uh, said he did give you consent to to drive the vehicle, so we're all good there. Oh, we're good. And uh, he does not want to press charges for the damage incurred on the vehicle because there was a little bit from your little uh, your little accident you had there. That wasn't my fault. I had right of way. I think. Yeah, I did. I was on the main right. road. I remember my driving test. My driving instructor was really ugly. All right, Mr. Ballsax. There's only one more thing we have to do. Now that's all cleared up. Uh, basically, the roadside breathalyzer you were administered is only a probable cause instrument. It is not admissible in court. What we need you to do is take one more breath sample at the um, at the actual larger machine over here uh, that will take a breath sample, which is admissible in court. No, the, okay. Wouldn't mind. The, the one that says broken printer under it, that machine. Uh, no, the one next, one next to the broken printer. Ah, uh, I see. The, the one the, that looks uh, like a TV. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, the one that looks like a fire extinguisher. Oh right, I really don't feel comfortable sucking on the end of that. <laughs> right. Hold on. Ah, oh, fuck it. What's the worst that can happen? Pop lungs. <laughs> All right. So you can start blowing. Uh, whatever you'd like. Fire extinguisher. <laughs> and 
that? Um, zero. It's gonna go down. I'm thinking zero point thirteen. All right. Come back in the cell over here. Appreciate it. And that means I passed, right? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You passed. Have you got any gum or candy? Uh, it's not allowed in the cell area. Sorry, it's literally the two items that are not allowed according to this here sign. Yeah, I saw that. I was just testing your knowledge. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Zero point one three. Yes. All right. Yeah. So as of right now, you are under arrest for a DUI resulting in property damage and the disorderly intox. So I'm also going to be writing you a citation for having an open alcohol container in your vehicle. There were about ten, but we'll only do one. Just because uh, feeling nice today, can, and, can I? Uh, we're also going to have. Can I point something out real quick? That no, I no. had right of way. That dude hit me. So I get the DUI, even though I was, free, I was told I could do that. But I don't agree with the property damage thing because that dude pulled in front of me. Okay, even if it, even if you're not at fault, an accident happened while you were under the influence. That's why you're getting that charge. But you just said I'm not at fault. Well, please, man. It does. I said it doesn't matter whether you're at fault or not. Uh, but if I'm not at fault, can't you just do the UI? I'm sorry. No, not really, sir. Okay, it's all right. <laughs> Let me keep explaining. So, like I said, uh, under arrest for DUI and property damage, disorderly intox. I also wrote you a citation for an open alcohol container and driving without your lights on. <laughs> It was daytime. It was not at all, sir. It was d dusk or dawn. I always had them mixed up. It was one of them two. It was like I could not, see. Not, not really. Not. I don't. I, well, clearly not, because you hit someone trying to make the left onto a Nicola place. So I got a ticket for having my lights on, and then I got a ticket for having my lights off in the same day. Well, from what I heard from Marcus, you were, had your high beams on. You see, there's like, there's, there's a setting in between that you're supposed to have. That's called your low beams. <sighs> That's so right, unfair. So Can you just shoot me in the head? I can't be bothered. <laughs> no, no, sir. Here's a copy of the arrest report and the traffic citation. I need you to sign at the bottom. Uh, both of those documents, not admission of guilt to anything. Just means to acknowledge what you're being cited and arrested for. There you go. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm <laughs> going for the uh, I know it's probably the last thing you want to hear, but due to the points on your license, there's also going to be a suspension of your license uh, due to the amount of points that have added up from today's citation. No. Are you sure you don't want to just shoot me? I do not, sir. Sorry about that. So. Right now you're being charged with the misdemeanor one and the misdemeanor two, so that is going to be a total of 90 seconds uh, in prison or a fine of $1,500. Oh, I'll take the jail. I can't afford that. Can you pay my ticket, though? No, and in fact, I am going to uh, invoice you for the two tickets that I uh, just gave you for the alcohol. You Both don't have to do that. It's fine. You can just keep them. I don't want them. How much was uh, it? Partner corrections down here, and they will be taking it from there. I'm not sure which one it is. 100, I think. That's not bad. Oh. Okay. If I was a cop, I'd drink my own pepper spray. I couldn't. Oh. I just teleported. <laughs> anyway, guys, that is going to do it for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. This was a bit of a random episode. That's probably one of the lesser charges I've ever got as, it, as one of my characters, so. That's something. Ah, but yeah, I'll keep you updated on Matthew's channel. Um, if you want to get more updates, then feel free to check out my Discord. There's a link in the description. And I will see you then. Peace out, guys.